So this is my precision sundial, also known as a heliochronometer. And the way it works is, first of all, this has to be aimed directly north, uh, north and south. It has to be aimed at the North Pole. So I've got it set up, aimed more or less north. And the second thing you do is you set it up. Um, I'll show there's a little scale here at the bottom. Hopefully you can see that. I'll try to zoom in on it. And this gives me my degrees of latitude. It has to be set up to the right degrees of latitude in order to work right. Put the focus on there. And so this is adjustable up and down. So you can see how that works. I'll swing it on around so you can get a little idea of the back side of it. And so you just adjust this to the proper degrees of latitude where you're at. Uh, digital uh, level works better, but I've got this set up and I'm about 34 degrees, so I'm going to set this about 34 degrees. It's good enough for demonstration purposes. So once you get that set up, then the next thing you do is there's a little um, this little back part here Swing the camera around a little. There's what they call the panorama, or this little figure eight. And you can see this part here, there's a little hole here in the front of it that the sun shines through. And you turn this until the sun creates a shadow, creates a little image of the sun down here on the bottom of this little figure eight. And you can see it. You should be able to see it right about there someplace. And so you put it on the line corresponding to the current month, which is just towards the end of May. You can see the little uh, little spot there of the sun. And once you set that up, then you just read the time off of the dial up here. And I'm going to spin this around so you can see it. So that tells you the correct time, which is just a little bit before 12 o'clock here at the moment. And so you set this up with your, use your watch to set this, and this is adjustable. So when you get this thing set up to the proper time, now this clock will tell time, accurate clock time, any time uh, throughout the summer. Right now it's set for daylight savings time. And it's adjusted for your latitude, uh, exactly where you are within your time zone. So this will always be accurate all summer, this will be accurate whenever you come out and, and turn this little dial and line up line up the um, target down here which I've moved it around so it's not accurate anymore but that'll be that'll be accurate all summer and then of course in the winter you can just move this dial when it goes to standard time you just move this dial an hour this way or that way to set it up for the standard time and so it's accurate. What this figure eight does is because the Earth orbits the uh, sun sometimes faster, sometimes slower, and that makes your clock run faster, slow. And so this calculates, that's called the equation of time. So this calculates it. So when the sun is moving faster or slower, it automatically compensates for that. So it'll tell you the accurate clock time regardless of the time of year or regardless of where you are once it's set up correctly. This one's only marked in 10 minute increments as you can see on the dial here. So mine's, if it's somewhere in between there you have to kind of figure well it's about a couple minutes between but that's pretty good. If I can figure it out within a minute or two I'm happy. So actually it's a pretty simple design. I've got a little little marking here that says sun so you can see that's supposed to aim at the sun and it's pretty accurate pretty simple to make doesn't take a lot of tools of course this one's made out of wood so I can't leave it out I either keep it covered or just bring it out for demonstration purposes someday I'll make one out of something a little more per uh, permanent but that's how it works and I hope other people can make something like this as well Kind of a cool little design, I thought. That just turns to whatever time it is. You just put the put the little 
dot on the on the line corresponding to the month. The time is going to be right on. Thanks for watching.